Hillsborough County needs to return a fortune to county taxpayers. It collected more than $500 million through an improper sales tax and now has to figure out how to issue refunds. Yeah, it's not an easy task. Mm. Fox 13's Craig Patrick shows us tonight how it's coming to a head here as we approach the new year. In 2018, Hillsborough voters passed an extra one cent sales tax to improve our roads. Then in 2021, the state Supreme Court found it unconstitutional because the referendum specified how the money should be spent when that power belongs to the commissioners. So the county found itself sitting on more than a half billion dollars. None of it's been spent because it was wrongly collected and none of it's been returned because the process for refunding it is in dispute. According to the county clerk's office, it's $521,183,433 to be exact. Still parked in an account where it's accruing less than 1% interest, that all needs to be refunded somehow. Um, if you do the math, there's over one and a half million population is about $300 for every man, woman, and child, or $1,200 for a family of four. Why in the world is the money still just sitting idle? Well, <laughs> you know, it's a hot mess, right? Karen Jarosz speaks for a group called Fix Our Roads First, which opposed the tax and now opposes the county's proposed method for refunding it. They entered their process, which would be very onerous to citizens of Hillsborough County. Um, in order to do a refund, you would have to show two and a half years of your receipts, your sales receipts, and then go before a three panel judge. And it, you know, the problem that, that I have with this whole process is you have the defenders of the illegal tax deciding the outcome, deciding the remedy. That shouldn't be happening. Actually, a remedy has not been decided. The county may want to go with the show your receipts and apply for a refund approach. But with a lawsuit in play, the court may have the final say. Commissioner Stacy White, who led the court fight to nix the tax, declined her interview request. But he shared his suggestions back in May. A sales tax holiday is something that would be very easy and equitable. Um, and certainly I'm open to the direct check idea. You know, we've talked a lot about COVID stimulus. What better way to offer some stimulus? That's where the Florida legislature could step in with a local bill to enable White's idea. The Department of Revenue could work with legislators to come up with a um, good bill to return the money fairly through a sales tax holiday. On January 26th, the judge in the legal dispute scheduled a discussion in which we might get a better idea of where this story is going and who will be refunded and how much they'll get. Craig Patrick, Fox 13 News. The Hillsborough Commission is also planning to put a new referendum on the ballot for 2022 to restore the sales tax in a way that does comply with the law.